Hello, today we're going to be printing color labels with the Epson Colorworks 3500 printer. And you can see here we're printing on craft beer labels, uh, custom uh, lotion or beauty products. Uh, we're going to do some coffees and I'll just show you how this all works. So we're going to start off with the coffee. And there's several colors of uh, different styles of labels that we're going to show you. So you can see here how you, you could print directly from a laptop and we're into a different template here now. This is, uh, we're printing just from Adobe Acrobat, just a PDFs. Um, there's several ways you'll be able to print. And now I'm going to apply the label. You can see what it looks like here on the coffee bag. So these are really good for people that are uh, can't justify printing thousands and thousands of labels. This gives you the convenience of printing your own and not in high quantities. So, you know, you don't have to go and print off millions. So you can see there the, the quality of this is, is pretty, pretty good. Uh, I believe it's 300 DPI. So then we're gonna go ahead and apply uh, this to a test bottle here. Um, you get the idea, uh, you know, you print your own labels and you apply them however ever you need, if you have a special applicator or if you just do them by hand. But you get the idea that you can now print your own labels, color labels, without the need of uh, ordering a tens of thousands of labels from a big print printing house. So the convenience of this is, is great for people who make custom beauty products, custom lotions, custom food products, you know, craft beers or craft coffees. That's where these uh, these machines are coming in the most handy is for those people that have the small and medium run. They need to be able to change on the fly. They don't have time or money to invest in tens of thousands of labels. And this is a great color label printer for people to be able to do that. And then we have several different kinds of beer brands here that we're, we're testing with. Uh, these again, we're just printing uh, PDFs. So the file is just a PDF file and uh, they work they work just fine you can you know, they make a they make the, that beer bottle look nice as your beers change you'll be able to customize them and you won't have to be locked into just one label and having thousands and thousands of them you, you know sometimes you might have to just change an ingredient maybe or a batch number or a lot number uh, speaking of lot numbers and batch numbers, we also have some inkjet printers that will print directly on the bottles, directly on a label, and it will just it's just a little uh, inkjet printer that will print a lot number uh, or expiry date or whatever that is that you need to put on there. I'll link that video here as well. You'll be able to watch that one because it's a very popular one, and that saves you a lot of trouble as well, being able to print uh, uh, special special things like lot numbers and batch numbers. This is a nice label here, though. The little hopper. Uh, it's a wheat beer, so it looks pretty good. I like that logo. So please, if you like this, uh, subscribe to these videos. And there's going to be an. I'll also link up the inkjet printer that you could print your own lot, batch, or expiry dates with that printer. It's very cool. So thanks again for watching. Subscribe if you like these, and go ahead and leave a comment if you like.